One of the hot topics in agriculture is cover crops. And for me, it comes down to two things. It needs to work for me, and it needs to be very, very simple. And so as I look at a simple program, in this particular seed field, where seed comes out early, right before tillage, we come in and we keep it very simple. We come in with a fertilizer buggy, with Ben Run wheat, and we just put it on and make a ripper pass in the standing stalks. The outcome is something I really like. We're gonna keep soil health here. We're gonna keep soil from moving in the spring. And then in this case, we'll come in and we'll burn this down and we'll work it with a vertical tillage harrows. We're right back in to next year's seed corn crop. At the same time, we're trying different approaches. We did this same thing with oats and radishes. And then we also at the dairy, I really like the program where we come in in the fall. In that case, we're using an air cart behind a Great Plains chopper harrow. And we're putting on 120 pounds of triticale. Triticale is nothing more than a wheat rye hybrid combination. It makes an excellent feed and it makes an excellent cover. And so after the corn crop, we come in at the harrow and we have did it twice, half rate, two different directions. And I'm excited the kind of cover that we have and the kind of growth that we have. We did cheat. We run that system here over the top of it and it definitely made a much better cover for us. But come May, I'm really gonna enjoy that kind of quality feed coming off with a wet baler. So all in all, covers need to work for me and I'm not for them. At the same time, I believe that soil health is a critical component to our farming system.